If you're trying to figure out how much starter to make so that you have enough for a recipe but you also don't end up with a whole ton of discard, then this video is for you. The first thing you're going to do is you're going to go to Google and you're going to type in starter calculator. There are other ones out there, but this is just the one that I've always used. Okay, and then you're going to select what feeding ratio you're using, followed by how much starter you need to make for your recipe. Underneath that, you're going to put in how much excess you want to carry over after you've used all the starter. And then it's going to tell you exactly what you need to feed your starter. So in this case, to a clean jar, I've added 45 grams of starter, I'm adding 90 grams of water, and the calculator told me to use 90 grams of flour, but because I like my starter a little bit thicker, I'm going ahead with 95 grams of flour and giving that a really good mix. Once my starter is ready to go and I've used all 200 grams for my recipe, you're going to see that I'm left with a small amount in my jar, which should be about 25 grams based on what I put in the calculator, and you can even make that a smaller amount so that you have less to continue to maintain. 